Chartlu allows you to create different alerts for all stocks and ETFs that are available in our database. These alerts allow you to be notified as soon as a preset condition is met for a specific instrument or even for an entire watchlist. A simple example is a price alert where you are notified as soon as the price of a stock reaches a predefined price. Some alerts can be set for a collection of stocks that are part of the same watchlist. As soon as an alert has been triggered, you will receive an email notification and if you have activated push notifications, you will also receive a pop-up notification on your screen. Before we explain the different types of alerts in more detail, it is important that your account is correctly set up to receive those alerts. To do so, in Chartmill, click on your username at the top right and choose My Account. It is important that at least personal alerts are checked. If you would also like to see these notifications appear on your screen, be sure to check the box next to Push Notifications. Setting up an alert can be done from both the stock charts and the stock screener page. To set up an alert for an individual stock or ETF, use the bell icon at the top right of the chart. If your view is set to tables, then you will see the same icon at the end of the table. Whatever view you use, the alarm icon is always visible on the page. If you would like to set up an alert for all the stocks in one of your watchlists, first select the watchlist and then click on the bell icon, to the right of the blue horizontal bar. This puts the alert into effect for all stocks that are part of that watchlist. After clicking on the alert icon, you will see the different options we will go through now. The first option is a simple price alert. You choose a price level and set Chartmill to notify you as soon as the price rises above this level or falls below it. The trading setup alert uses the technical and setup ratings automatically generated by Chartmill. For both filters, you set a rating between 0 and 10, where higher is better. Both scores are part of the Chartmill analysis reports that qualify a stock from a price perspective. There is a technical rating, this is a score between 0 and 10, that quantifies the technical health of a stock. The higher the score, the stronger the stock's trend. The technical rating also focuses on long setups. And a setup rating. This is a score between 0 and 10 that quantifies the quality of the setup pattern. The setup score checks whether a good entry and exit point can be found on the chart. The Chartmill technical rating quantifies the technical health of the stock, taking into account both the long and short term timeframes as well as the position of the stock in the universe of stocks. The score takes into account the relative strength of the stock, the historical relative strength and its evolution, the long and short term trend and several moving averages and the position of the price compared to them. The Chartmill setup quality score quantifies the quality of the setup pattern. Typically, a good setup is available when the stock is forming some kind of consolidation or base pattern. Several properties are taken into account, whether or not the current prices are not too far from short-term moving averages, whether or not recent prices are in the same area, whether or not there is a support zone below the current price, and whether or not volatility is decreasing. Bonus points are given when, for instance, large players are entering the stock and if there are recent pocket pivots. Keep in mind that both scores are independent of each other, thus it is perfectly possible for a stock to have a very good technical score without being an interesting setup at the same time. And this is also true the other way around. A stock can show a good setup and still have a low technical score. Quarterly or annual earnings announcements can have a big impact on the price of a stock and in many cases the stock price will also become more volatile as the announcement date approaches. Especially as far as open positions are concerned, it is important to know when results are announced in order to avoid surprises. But this can be equally important for momentum traders, who are just looking for stocks that move strongly. Whatever the reason, it doesn't really matter. The point is that with this earnings alert, you can get early warning when such news will be announced. And you can opt to be notified one day, two days or one week in advance. The news alert is triggered when a press release is issued for the underlying stock. This alert is frequently set together with the earnings alert. Insider buying refers to the purchase of shares of a company's stock by individuals who have access to non-public information about the company. These individuals are typically company executives, directors or employees. Insider buying is reported to regulatory authorities and made publicly available. Insider buying can be seen as a positive signal because it suggests that those who know the company best, its insiders, are confident about its future prospects. 
When insiders buy shares, it indicates that they believe the stock is undervalued or that they have positive expectations about the company's performance. The most recent and largest insider transactions can be consulted via the main menu by clicking on Insider Trading. For insider transactions in specific stocks, select the Ownership tab on the profile page of the stock in question, then click on Insider Owners. The Fundamental Alert notifies you as soon as new fundamental data is available in Chartwell. This item is closely related to the Earnings Alert. As soon as the fundamental data for the most recent quarter or year are available in the platform, you will be alerted. If you check the new Analyst Ratings Alert, you will be alerted as soon as a new Analyst Rating is available for the stock you are monitoring. Analyst Ratings are available for all stocks in our database and can be consulted on the profile page of the stock via the tab Analyst Ratings. With the Saved Screen Alert, you will be alerted as soon as one or more stocks you are already watching meets all the characteristics of one of your saved screens. An example to make this clear, suppose you have created a technical screen that you use to find stocks that have reached a new annual high. Instead of using the screen only to search for new stocks, you can set it as an alert to a previous selection of stocks that you already keep in a watch list because of specific other characteristics. As soon as one or more stocks in your watch list meets the parameters of the screen, you will be notified. The trading idea page contains a lot of different screens for every kind of trader. The different options allow you to select very specific trading ideas, based on technical or fundamental analysis, focused on the short, medium or long term and much more. You can find the page by clicking on the trading ideas section in the main menu on the left. But did you know that you can also set these trading ideas as alerts? The only condition is that you designate a number of trading ideas as favorites. By selecting favorites only, you will only see the trading ideas you have liked. Add your favorite trading ideas by clicking on the heart icon. All your favorite trading ideas can then be set as an alert on an individual stock or on a watch list. After you have set several alerts, you can always consult them via your account page. Click on the Manage Alerts button at the bottom to get an overview of all your active alerts. You can also consult your personal alerts in the User Feed section of the main menu. To do so, click on the icon next to User Feed and then select Personal Alerts. If an alarm is already active for a particular security, when you click on the alarm icon, you will find a second tab Existing Alerts next to the Create Alert tab. Click this to see which other alerts have already been set for this security. If certain alert options are colored light gray, it means they are not available because the data is not available in Chartmill. More info on what kind of data is available for which markets in Chartmill can be found in the main menu under the item Screener Market Data. As you may have already noticed, there are many types of alerts available in the platform. Use these to monitor existing positions or to get timely alerts should new opportunities arise in the stocks you are already monitoring via a watch list. Hopefully this video has made it clear to you how to do that in the most quickest and easiest way. Any questions or comments, leave them below in the comment section and we'll be sure to answer them. Don't forget to give us a like and subscribe to our channel to be notified as soon as new instructional videos are published. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.